Hello everyone! Today, let's take a look at the basic writing knowledge of prompts. Prompt is the most crucial step for you to generate images. A good prompt can make your images full of details and coherence. In this video, we will introduce the writing form of prompts, the basic structure of prompts, and some advanced techniques. Let's see how to write a good prompt. First of all, we need to understand what a prompt is. Click on the text to image in the global sidebar. You can enter your prompt here, and then click Generate. You can see that the result is generated according to the prompt we wrote. Overall, a prompt is a textual description that tells artificial intelligence what kind of image to create. It can shape all aspects of the final image, from large images to the tiniest details. Generally speaking, the better the prompt is, the better the image will be. In the past, when we generated images, we always used short phrases or tags to write prompts. But design can now understand natural sentence style prompts and even respond better to sentence style prompts. Pro tips, use natural language to describe the picture, just as you would when speaking to others. You don't need to assign weights, such as the method of using parentheses to increase weights in web UI. You don't need to use computer languages to describe the picture, such as RGB values or technical signs. Now we know how to write prompts, but we still need to understand one key point of prompts, clear description. When you describe a character or scene, if you want to control multiple parts of the image, you should express the content you want to generate as clearly as possible. All the details that can be visually seen can be written down. You can see that although this short prompt generated very stunning pictures, the detailed prompt generated the sea view I wanted. Even cooler is that you can now generate the text you want. As long as you describe the font, style effects, and color of the text in detail, design will generate the text you want. You already know how to write a good prompt. Now it's time to learn about the structure of a prompt. A good prompt can be divided into seven parts. Image summary, details of the main object, poses and actions, secondary elements of the picture, settings and background, lighting and atmosphere, framing and composition. In the image summary section, you need to briefly describe your image in one sentence. Just imagine how you would express yourself when you see this photo. If you can only describe the prompt in one sentence, then this sentence is what you want to write well. In the main object section, you need to provide more information about the main object in the image. You need to describe the main object precisely in all aspects you can think of. In the posture and position section, you need to describe what the subject is doing or what position the subject is in. In the secondary elements section of the picture, you need to describe the secondary elements surrounding the main subject. Their main function is to enhance the details of characters, perfect the story of the entire picture, or establish a relationship with the surrounding scenes, making things more full and rich. In the settings and background section, you need to describe the background, time period, or place where the subject is located, or even a historical moment in which the subject is situated. In the lighting and atmosphere section, you need to briefly describe the tone and atmosphere of the picture in one sentence. In the framing and composition section, you need to briefly describe the positional relationship between the main subject and other secondary elements in one sentence. That's all. Now that you already know the structure of an excellent prompt, let's combine them to form a complete prompt. In this picture, this man is placed right in the center of the picture to give a speech and the crowd below cheers for him. The entire photo is real and infectious. In this picture, the posture and text of this dolphin have been perfectly generated, and the completeness of the entire design can even be used directly. In this picture, the entire scene is very much in line with the characteristics of watercolor painting, and the relationship between the main figure and other elements is also very harmonious. You have now learned how to independently write a good prompt, but there are still some advanced techniques that you can learn. 
Prompt Improver is an exclusive AI polishing tool of design. It can help you refine your prompts and add more details to your images, making the images you generate more coherent. You can see that this man has changed into a short sleeve shirt with white clouds, and the background has been changed to a bedroom. This is Seed. If you want to repeatedly generate similar images with the same person or object, you can input the same seed and make them make some minor changes on the same image. Furthermore, in Image to Image, you can also use the Describe Canvas function to describe the images you upload. It will help you summarize the images on your canvas and directly input the text into the prompt. You can make changes to the prompt based on this. You're now a prompt pro. Head over to design using the link to try it yourself.